Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Tug of War, the epic struggle between me and Jackie Fish, the elves versus dwarves. This is episode number 12? 11, I think. 11? 11 I completely yeah. forgot. It's been a while. We yeah, took a week a off. Week. Yeah. We, well, you know, we have to let our troops you know, rest a little yeah, bit. We gotta they've been at war for, arms. you know, you don't go to war in the winter, so they had a, a winter month, month off to, to rest, yeah. don't want to suffer attrition. I mean, like, elves don't grow on trees. <laughs> you gotta train them. Or do they? Like, or do dwarfs, they? dwarfs sprout from the ground, so... That's true. I could see elves coming from trees, you know, that's why <laughs> they have a close relationship with ints. Yeah, yeah, it makes sense. <laughs> so, you beat me last tug of war, I did. and now you have almost a thousand gold advantage. Yeah, it was and big money last time. Big money. It was huge money, yeah. Um, so yeah, you have 23,895, I have 22,910, and for today's battle, we are fighting for 1,080. Wah -wah. Very small. <laughs> like, nothing compared to the last battle whatsoever. Yeah, it's pretty much like, whoever wins this battle, it doesn't matter, they're screwed. If I win, I'm screwed, because there's no way I'm going to take your, your castle. And if you win, I doubt you'll be able to take mine, so... It's going to be tough. It's you underestimate tough. my power. That's true. I, I shouldn't do that. <laughs> All you have to you do is just rush ground. the walls. Yeah. Um, yeah, cool. Okay. Um, is there anything else that we need to mention um, here? Real quick? Well, I guess we can bring up siege towers, which we're going to be... To kind of speed this up a little bit, we're going to be giving the, the next siege... We're going to be giving the players siege towers. So yeah. before you had to spend an upgrade, and now we're deciding just to kind of give up give up the siege towers for free, just to kind of make the sieges a little bit more competitive. Yeah. And we're, you, also, we want tug of war to uh, you know come to a close eventually. You know, yeah. you don't want it to go on forever. Yeah. So uh, yeah, you want to go ahead and uh, check out the armies now. The armies, the beautiful army of dragon slayers I have mustered for this <laughs> battle. Yeah, let's do your army first. Let's we'll do okay, that. Okay, cool. Well, here's my battle. How funny would it be if I didn't actually upgrade to dragon slayers and I just got like, I don't <laughs> even know what else I could get. <laughs> but, ballista. Yeah, I guess I could. Or like, I like I managed to secretly upgrade a ballista, but just didn't bring it like five episodes ago and just didn't tell you about yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> And now I have catapults or something. That'd be hilarious. But yeah, no, I did. I did get dragon slayers, and look how much they cost me now. I've got so many of them that look at that number. That is a huge number. So yeah, my army pretty much just consists of dragon slayers. I'm more than happy to say that because I think you know. But I did also bring a small skirmisher composition, which I don't normally bring. So hopefully they pay right. dividends. That's what I'm hoping. Um, I doubt it. We'll Ooh, see. I'm sure they will. And uh, for my army here are the elves. Uh, I went with a pretty balanced build, and I upgraded to a ballista. Ooh. But I'm Go not bringing it to the battlefield. Going for the killing blow, hey? Trying to, going for the, trying the, to plan the win. for the future. I gotta win this battle, though, so... Yeah, gotta do that first. Yeah. Cool. So, let's begin. Yeah. Oh, how much money? Did you say how much money we're playing for? Uh, yeah, I said at the beginning. Oh, really? 1,080. Come oh. on, Jackie Fish. <laughs> Just wasn't paying attention. I was too busy scaring <sighs> all my dragon slayers. Oh, all your dragon slayers. Oh. You're just a hater. <laughs> well, good thing I don't have any dragons on my army. Yeah, to be fair, I, I was kind of stupid not bringing... I mean, bringing them when you don't have any dragons. Yeah, seriously. Oh, look at them all. They're beautiful. I also upgraded their armor as well. Well, that's so, cool. Hopefully that just makes me a, a little yeah. bit stronger against all your all your arrows. Because all I need to do is get them into combat, and I, sh I should be fine, right? That's what I'm hoping. Yeah, you, sh you should be fine, but we'll see what, see what happens. Just sticking, <laughs> the, just sticking everyone into loose formation straight away, as, as normal. <laughs> the joys of fighting the elves. It just makes it so annoying, because I always forget to, like... To stick them back into tight formation, like there's like there's always one unit I just forget to do it on. Like oh, always. to put it, yeah yeah that is it, it's can be hard in the heat of a battle you know. Yeah, oh, they look awesome as well, especially that picture. Beautiful, right, twenty one defense. That's what we Jeez. like to see. To be fair though, my warriors are still sixteen, I think, so it's not like they're that much. That much I don't worse. know. That's that's a pretty big difference. Yeah, I guess, I guess it's like a quarter difference. 
Alright, let's see how this turns out. Oh, also, I don't think we mentioned it, actually, that our generals, if we lose our general now, oh, right. we lose a 1,000 gold for it instead of yeah, 250. We, yeah, we, we bumped it up to a 1,000 because we're making so much gold. We want higher penalties. We're making so much bank. More risk. Yeah, so much bank. All right, I'm ready when you are. Uh, hold on, I'm just sticking everyone into the exclamation, getting everyone ready. Slatter oh, the Dwarven Are you scum. ready, Dragon Slayers? Are you ready? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I just really hope that they do live up to my expectations, because I've been kind yeah. of hoping or holding on to these guys for quite a while. Cool, are you ready? Yeah? Yeah. My I, I always love that. Uh, oh no, it's still on H. My run button is still on H. Oh, that sucks. I swear I could have ch I changed it, but apparently not. All my men as well go into like like a marching column whenever I tell them to advance. It's really annoying. Uh, all that cav. I didn't really bring that many. Oh no, not fire arrows. The hell, why are you using fire arrows? Oh, Iron Brow is moving up. <laughs> by himself, which probably isn't the best idea. Oh, jeez. I will have T Baggins' head on a spike by the end of this battle. Don't you? No! Worry. Stop using fire arrows! God! Whoa, them warriors are getting chewed up, though. Run away! See, this is why I turn off skirmish mode, because if you get too close, they just freak out and they never listen. Oh, I should have been focusing down your dragon slayers. Whoa, oh well. No, leave them alone. They've done nothing yeah. to you. I want a fair fight. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You go on a camp. Yeah, I don't want to camp, that's for sure. Run away. Oh, not this tactic. Where you just keep on moving back through lines after lines after lines <laughs> after lines of archers. Old archers. Oh. All right, let's let's focus the uh, dragon slayers here. The warriors are dead for or done for. That's what you think. Really, they're going to be the MVP of this battle. Uh. Get the cavalry around the flanks. That's what we like to see. Probably should micro this cavalry. Make sure everyone's in tight formation. God, I feel like I'm an MLG pro already. God, except you from, pretty much are. Except from the fact I just pressed. Uh, are on my dragon slayers to actually uh, run, so they've just been walking for quite a while. Which probably wasn't the best idea, but <laughs> we will we'll persevere. Get some cavalry charges in. Cool, my dragon yeah, slayers yeah. are now in. Oh, there's a big old gap in your line as well. Are we taking these gaps? No, it, it won't last for long. Oh, it will. Don't worry. God, your army is massive. It's the might of the dwarfs. Oh, you're starting to you're starting to see holes in your lines. I just need my infantry to stop. Just to hold their line. Oh, look at them, my men running through the gaps. That's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Getting onto your archers. That's all I need them to do. Oh, Jesus. I need to make sure I've got everyone in tight formation as well, because I... Oh, my God. T. Baggins is dead. Huzzah! What? what? Where, where no! How? Where was he? Yes. How did he die? Oh, brilliant. T. Baggins' head will be on a spike. Oh, my God. How did he die? Huzzah. He was in the like... fight for, like, three seconds. You know, I bet his own, like... Men killed him. Yeah, Failed like friendly the last fire. Time. Yes, now. Look at the envelopment happen. <laughs> T. Baggins is dead. Good, that's where he deserves to be. Oh, how could you say that, you jerk? <laughs> oh, now we can just watch the Dragon Slayers just clean up. Oh. I mean, I've got pretty good flanks everywhere else as well. Like, your armies... This is what I needed to do last battle. I just couldn't quite get Yeah, you just didn't it. have the uh, strong enough infantry. Yeah, but now my, my infantry is actually lasting against your men. Like before, your infantry were beating me in a 1v1. But now, 
So, yeah, because of the dragon slayers. So you lose, a, you actually lose money this episode. If I lose the battle, yeah, it's not oh, over yeah, yet, obviously, son. Obviously, yeah, obviously it's not over yet. But even if you win, you'd only have like 80 gold, <laughs> which is hilarious to take on to the next Yeah, battle. that's true. That's true, because we lose, yeah, you lose a thousand, so. But I got, I got the main problem sorted. I got your archers to stop shooting. Yeah, that's true. I mean, they can fight in melee, though, so don't. Yeah, but I'd much rather them fighting in melee than shooting me to death. That's true. Those are true statements. <laughs> now I just need my Dragon Slayers to do what they're supposed to do. Come on. I still believe. Maybe a new general will rise from the ranks. Mm, I don't know. T Baggins, he's... He was a hard act to follow. He did, he did save you from all that time ago. He did save me multiple times. This is a very tragic yeah, loss. I think you're gonna like even though I killed your general, which is good, but I don't know. I feel like your infantry is just holding again. They're doing an amazing job. My dragon slayers oh, yeah. are starting to dwindle. This is a lot closer than I thought it would be after killing your general so easily. Oh come on, don't break a unit of nineteen. Nah, I think you got this. I hope. I really hope so, but still, this is crazy close. Like I, after King Solon's general, I would not expect it to be going so on close. this long. Like your infantry is really underrated. Yeah, I don't know why people think the elves' infantry. Like if these is are just weak. your swordsmen holding. Like you've won on that right flank. It's just I've won on my left flank. And all the, I think this battle, if I do win it, is completely down to my crossbowmen I brought. <laughs> <laughs> a little skirmisher. Maybe. The skirmisher component. God, we actually have some cavalry right next to each other. Just, just really? killing. Oh, he stopped broken. That, uh, or yeah, breaking, same, that's it why. It was the same with mine. I almost oh, ran yeah. my general into your spikes as well. Which would have been Oh, that would have been beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, my dragon slayers are enveloped. Four Come you? on! We can turn this around. Fight for T Baggins! T Vagans is dead. If if you do lose this battle, I'm gonna get his body and I'm gonna put his head on my spike. Oh god, you're horrible. And I'm gonna catapult him into the city when That's I come to horrible. siege you. Have some respect. I mean Iron Brow does not care about T Vagans. He slaughtered his friend Kazarik. And Kazarik's son. And pretty much every other general I've ever had, T Vagans dealt with him. Oh come on, we can turn this around. Oh my god, we're turning it around. On that right flank, yeah, but on the left flank. I think, I think we can do this. For the memory of T Baggins. They're like, well, how can we win this battle without T Baggins? And they're like, T Baggins is, is in all of us. We are all T Baggins. Yep, I think. Oh, I don't know, this is, uh, this is awesome how close it is. I'm really, like... These factions are actually really balanced at this point. I just gotta deal with your cav. No. Oh my god, I am turning this around. Be mad, Jackie Fish. Hey, it's a fair fight. I'm not mad about, about losing a good battle. I killed your general as well, so you only actually get 80 gold, so I think I, I, know, I have I more, more gold than you anyway, so... Maybe if your general lives. Yeah, the, what's the deal with that? That sucks. What? What sucks? You're gonna have more gold than me, <laughs> even a, though you lost the battle. In a siege battle. Yeah, Oh. That's gonna be pretty brutal for you. Man, dwarves have no stomach to fight. Yeah, the dwarves are routing. If they all stood, I think I might have, might have been able to do this, but they're not, so... I'm, I'm really surprised by that. Like, yeah, that's impressive from the elves. Like, what the hell? Oh, come on. Just one arrow. Just hit Iron Fine Brow Denmark. on the back. Well, he's not even bloodied up. God, that... You know, it's not even my fault that he died. Like, that was just dumb luck. <laughs> I've literally got like so just a unit of crossbowmen left. 
and some maximum. I can't believe T Baggins is dead. I'm happy he's dead. He deserves to be dead. Now the funny thing would be if my crossbowman just killed everything you had. <laughs> that would be amazing. <laughs> that would be amazing. I'd be super pissed, but I'd also be like, wow, that's amazing. I'm so pissed right now, but that's amazing. <laughs> God, his battle's so close. Like, I could bring him in, but it's just not worth losing in battles and gold for him. Like, this battle could still... Because your morale isn't great. I mean, I guess they're eager. Um, I mean, I don't think there's a way you can win. Okay. Where there's a will, there's a way. Where there's See, not... <laughs> I don't know. I just don't get it. <laughs> get what? Just like, my infantry's good. Yeah. But when it comes to like fighting on the walls in a siege battle, I got nothing. But now you and have Lister, gonna... so you can actually smash down parts of a wall. You gotta remember that now. I, I think just the gate. I don't think you can actually use the ballista on the wall. Oh, really? Yeah. I could be wrong, though. Yeah, I'm not too sure about that, actually. I'll let my crossbowmen fight to the last. Alright guys, so if you're watching this, um, need uh, a new general name because... <laughs> it, yes. Uh, I mean a general, uh, I guess like a, a, a captain took his place and was giving orders and he did yeah, a good job. And, a very good job. So, so yeah. Because he, he fell, but I don't... Oh, I just, I came so close. This is the closest I've come to winning a field battle, obviously apart from the first one which I won. But yeah, like, I'm, so, a, I'm actually kind of surprised. I'm like, what are you going to do to beat me? Like, you can't yeah. beat me. Hey, like, you, well, you, you think, if I, re if I can replace my warriors with Iron Guard, because Iron Guard will be my next upgrade. So if I can replace my, my like, four, I think I had four or five units of warriors on the front line. If I can replace that with Iron Guard, you know, they're just as good as Dragon Slayers, but with better charge. You know, that's all it is. Yeah, that's um, But true. yeah, cool. <laughs> I'm not going to sit here and cheat you with my crossbowmen. <laughs> <laughs> or am I? <laughs> no, I'm not. I was, I was concerned. Okay, that. I was like, what? my general's no. my general's out of the battle now. Uh, we've yeah, we yeah. agree on that. Cool. Yeah. yeah. So there's no way I could get him anyway. Yeah, and I'm gonna go ahead and admit defeat. Then give up the battle. Oh, so we are back to the back to my city. You do have ballista, which should make the siege a little bit more e close. And the siege tower. Yeah, and the siege towers as well. Yes. So yeah. even though your men might struggle on the wall, you do have that extra protection to actually get your men up on the wall. Look at the size of your army. Yeah, it was pretty big. It just wasn't enough this time. Close, though. Um, let me know as well, if you're watching my point of view, or even if you're watching Apollo's point of view, let me know if it was better just to stick my, my Dragon Slayers into Shield Wall when I was in combat. Because I'm not really too sure, because I don't really play the Dwarfs as much as, as I should. So, let me know. Tips. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah. One of my Dragon yeah. Slayers killed 122. I'm I'm sure going to I'm sure jeez sure words are hard. I'm sure I'm going to get a lot of comments saying that oh Apollo you lost this battle and then they're going to watch the end and be like oh never mind. <laughs> See that <laughs> epic combat. I thought I had it, you know. I thought after killing yeah. your general your elves wouldn't be Oh yeah, I thought it was sturdy. done for. I was pissed. But your infantry man held in. It's impressive. Yeah, it, it really is. And even though you lost, it really wasn't that much of a defeat. No, because you have more money. Yeah, because uh, like you want more baggins. money. Yeah. So we're back at your castle next round, game 12 of Tug of War. Yep. And it's going to be a big one. Um, but again, it's going to be another tough battle for me. We'll see what I can do. I mean, you have and... a lot of, lot of different stuff that you didn't have before. You have Siege Towers, you have Ballista. You know, you're, you're getting towards that end game type of finishing move you need you know the yeah, zodia of, of, of units to finish me off yeah. i just got to get those ints <laughs> yeah oh my god that's gonna be brutal but i'm looking forward to it yeah so uh thanks for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it and we're gonna end it here